a lot of talk in the town was who is going to get the tweak win? Is anyone going to get the tweak win? Because <laughs> it's a very valuable win. As you know, a very late addition to this tournament. Um, so everyone's discussing who could beat him. And being as the event is PGR ranked, it's a very good win to hold. Right, right. Definitely and you will hold a lot of PGR kudos. And, I mean, just increases your chance chances of getting into that top 50, right? Every, and that's always a such a big opportunity for all these players on the come up because once you get onto that, you get way more leverage in terms of, like, pitching for sponsors and yada yada, right? It's... Like, it, it lends itself a lot to how to really make something out of playing Smash. Yeah. And my personal vote for the most likely player, if it were to happen, happened to be Venia. Right. That That's not the buzz, right? Um, Correct. Right. No, actually, I had Venia over the buzz. Okay, okay. My personal pick, I feel like Venia is consistent enough with how he wants to play Greninja that against any of Tweak's competent characters, I feel like he could do well. Okay. It's a matter of getting the win that's going to matter. Yeah. I mean, that, that's a very, very fair point. And Venia is a very talented player. And of course, rocking that Greninja, definitely um, not the most common character as well. So definitely might be able to throw a tweak for a loop. Maybe not, might know all the Greninja tech. Oh man, and Venia is getting shot up right now. Doesn't convert off of it. Does, does get a good amount of chip damage though. Yeah, this is going to be a very particular matchup just because Greninja has a lot of speed that gives him that presence of being able to be right in Joker's face regardless of how Tweak wants to handle this matchup. I like the bit of a slower start. Starting winner's finals on Smashville is probably the um, probably the best option, I would say, for Tweak, just because it's not a lot of real estate. Like, Greninja's going to be able to zip around any of the legal stages. Yeah. So you might as well try and mitigate that as much as you can without giving Venny a final destination. Right. And, I mean, even just thinking about for, uh, for Venia, if he, he already got the win on the buzz. If he's also able to get this win on Tweak as well, that would be huge for him. He's doing a very, very good job right now. Has the Arsene out, and this is where it, uh, how well can you play versus the Arsene? Because he is definitely in kill percent. Arsene is almost out though. He's getting shot up here, stalling. He's got one ledge drive. Wow, he's just, or he's gonna wait the whole time. All right. Yeah, yeah, that was really great stuff from Venia. He he just waited, waited it out, and it it paid off. And now he has no Arsene, 134 percent here. No back here off the Trump. Yeah, getting the kills, I feel, is going to be the most difficult part for Venia here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. As mentioned, he has earlier, rage though. Oh, he's got rage, and this is Greninja. Oh, oh! One plats aren't in the way. Yeah, you were talking about that earlier. That is so unfortunate. He actually had that stock. If the up smash fully connect, Tweak was super dead. Oh, the back air though, going okay. right underneath that side B. What a play! So this is a this is a great instance of good idea, bad idea. Good idea. We saw earlier Tweak responded to back air by taking out the rebels guard. So he okay. was able to burn plenty of rebel uh, meter, get himself prepared to have Arsene live. Right. Bad idea. Using Aha to try and zone out Greninja. He's very weak as a character, so he's going to be able to slip right on past as necessary. But on top of that, he's very swift. Aha's not the greatest of projectiles. Maybe it would have been a better option with Iaga, but using too much Enlight to be able to properly punish, so he just ate that whole back air. And this is a really good opener for Venia because he has popped the Arsene. He's only at 39%, so it's very unlikely that Tweak is going to get the stock off of this. He might take some damage, but honestly, he's playing so well. He's not even taking that much damage. This Arsene is almost about up. Ah, and he's also going to set up this offstage situation. Tries to get the uh, Hydro Pump squirt going, but does not connect. Yeah, Grappling Hook operates really strangely around win boxes. For the most part, Tweak should be fine when he's recovering. Although, if he tries to stall his recovery for any reason, either some sort of mix-up or Venus occupying space with rising up air, potentially, that's where it's going to be a little weird. So yeah. seeing how well Tweak responds to that type of a situation wow. is going to be important. But we got to see how well he responds to being a stock down on Venia, who's too fairly healthy on his second stock. Yeah, that was a very solid confirm coming out from Venia. Now he has a very big lead, the stock lead and the Arsene, quote unquote, lead. Um, so let's see if he can get some kind of string going here to pop this Arsene. Oh, OK, we got the <laughs> footstool out of shield into the gun. That is a true punish. And uh, it, it's similar to what we saw earlier from uh, Venny. He did the footstool into the down air. Okay, cool. but the, the Arsene is out here. See if uh, we can even get more value out of uh, Venia and go through this Arsene without losing the stock here. 
Already about half meter gone. Venia definitely of the school of thought where instead of camping out uh, Arsene, predominantly just beating it out of Joker, has a lot of value to him. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it works out completely fine. And now the Arsene is completely out. Down to, oh no, gonna go with the up smash there. You're the deepest of scoops. I know, right? I mean, you usually don't see that move scoop that hard, but really great up smash coming out from Tweak, and he's gonna get these uh, bread and butters from the throws here. Okay, the down gun, but wow, Greninja's slipping right underneath it. it. Looked like he ran through the guns. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, the, the gun reshoot rate's not incredibly fast with non Arsene, right? So it's like pop, pop, pop. Okay, slowly but surely, Tweak just chipping away at this lead that uh, Venia has made. And wow, and he's doing it with no Arsene as well. That's the scary thing. Gets the Nair. Can he finish it off? Ooh, tries to take him off the top with the up air, but that down gun is such a good, like, anti-juggle tool, right? Yeah, you can't, like, even though Greninja has the speed to be able to get around it, like, you can't just commit to trying to land on or around uh and Arsene, Greninja. it might come out to play pretty soon, unless Venia closes out the stock right now, and yep. that is what he's going to do. Very impressive play because the Arsene was going to come out. So he had to just go for a play that would kill him outright. You don't want to just deal damage because then you got to deal with Arsene, right? right. Like Max Rage Arsene, no one wants to be in that position. He's picking a good, a good amount of times when he wants to combo, when he wants to just kill. Right. And that type of decision making, especially like in this type of a pressured situation, this is winner's finals in the tournament. Like... You gotta be able to like be fine about when you're picking that, where you are on the map when you're picking that too, especially as Greninja, because he could very easily just sort of fly off the rails with his speed. And all of a sudden you could find your battle happening off stage where you might not be prepared for that. So you gotta use your resources, come on back. Yeah, yeah. So very impressive game number one. It looks like we're going right back to Smashville here. Uh, Tweak very down to play on the stage. I, I think he's just comfortable maybe with the platform in the center. Maybe he just likes the, uh, mainly the platform layout. I feel like this is a fantastic stage for Joker, so picking back into it makes it makes sense. It's just a matter of mitigating, like, how well is Venya going to be able to land on you? Because yeah. he just comes in with that Nair, and you have to be prepared. Like, look at all that damage right off the bat. We even have Arsene super early in on this. Yep, again, once again, Arsene coming out around the 42% mark, and uh, Tweak's going to have to get a very good series of plays here to get this stock. And I... I Right, what I really like from Venia as well, he is doing such a great job of not getting ledge trapped. But I guess the down air will connect and kill kill this man at like 60 or so, 60 or 70, he got that down air. Awakened down air is super good for fighting Greninja because it's worth noting, like Joker still has that slash. So it's right. covering a wide amount of space. And then Arsene comes out. Of course, Arsene is the stomp that really leads into all the shenanigans you've come to expect from Joker at this point. But that slash to open up into the second hit, the stomp, is really important against Greninja because he low profiles, but he's still fairly long. Right, right. And just like that, man, look at all this damage. And even the cherry on top, the side B at the end of the combo, just for that, uh, the dot damage, damage over time. Down to into the forward air. Is center stage, so not gonna do too much. And I like all this stalling with all the special moves there. Really great recovery coming out from Tweak. There's so much merit to being able to change how you fall, and the fact that Joker has so much in his kit that lets him adjust to that speed, yeah, is it's so good. It's uh, it's very good to have. Uh, I definitely think Gun is his best move overall. Like when you look at just Joker overall as a character, Gun is so good in so many situations. Wow, he almost connected and comboed off of that. Oh, is that okay? More damage here. Okay, throw won't kill just yet. Oh, jeez. Throw a bad DI. Yikes. Oh, Forward dude. throw coming up from Tweak. Going to be able to be just enough. Yeah, that was a big yikes for sure. Maybe he thought he was going to down throw, so he was DIing to the right there. I guess. <laughs> he, even at that down throw becomes dangerous too. I think this could also be a measure of unfamiliarity because we don't have a lot of jokers in New York in the dead scheme of things. Oh, okay, okay. And I didn't know that. All right, so yeah. that, that he hasn't... Venia, this is probably like the best joker he's fought or like one of the few jokers he's fought like offline tournament environment at this level yeah no, in any level i feel like tweak is easily the best joker that he has seen by a mile thus far and this is a matter of venia feeling his way through the dark and just fighting more tweak than he is fighting joker okay that's fair enough because I, I doesn't wishes play joker he does but wishes and venia don't have a lot of tournament overlap 
Oh, I see, I see. So they don't, they don't meet each other. Yeah. Bracket. Okay. Venia only very recently has started traveling to a ton of stuff. Meanwhile, Wishes, unless it's like some sort of major, stays fairly rooted in central New Jersey. Oh, okay, okay. But with that being said, Venia has been holding himself pretty well. But this game two looking mighty fine for Tweak as he's already on route to secure the win. Yeah, good friends about to come out. Name's Arsene, and when Arsene comes out, when you're in advantage state, that's so broken. Because usually Arsene, nine times out of ten, Arsene comes out when you're in disadvantage because you got hit and it comes out. But wow, Venia racking up this damage, both of them <laughs> countering. <That's> pretty funny. <laughs> but uh, Tweak will close it out there with the forward tilt. Very solid game number two, and on the same stage as well. So we'll see if uh, I mean we might have all the games. It'll, it'll be hyped to see five games on Smashville, but we'll see if any... Ooh, uh... Trip down memory lane, but <laughs> we're not going to get that. We are going to see Town and City, though, so not I'll too different. Town and City. All right, all right. Keeping it, keeping it Animal Crossing. So Town and City, uh, definitely a very different stage in Smashville, right? Like one of the bigger stages, very high ceiling as well. Yes. Um, becomes FD for a little bit. So, I mean, you were saying that uh, Venia likes FD, so this is probably why he's picking it, because it's the closest thing you can get to FD that's not FD. Yeah, I'm almost certain that Tweak is making sure that FD never sees the light of day in this set, and with very good reason. That being said, though, Town & City does have some merit behind Joker. You can make plenty of good use out of the different platform layouts. Joker in his own right makes FD work pretty well. And in general, the stage is fairly spacious. Okay, it looks like we got the jab lock. Almost connects the down tilt into the up air, but the pressure just keeps coming on. And look at these gun cross-ups as well. Tweak making very good use of these tools. But Venia coming in with the water shurikens as well. Drifting back with the forward airs. That man, and that Greninja dash tag is so good. It's really good. And it gives just the openings that Venia needs for trying to maintain these juggles. But more importantly, it's really anything that Venia needs. But down air to up smash is going to be what's going to put even more damage. Tie things basically dead even. Yeah, and we still got about a third of Arsene left. But Venia gets a hit. This is big. This could drain out the whole Arsene, especially on this ledge trap here. I feel like Ven Venia hasn't fully figured out how he can take advantage of the Wings of Rebellion. And I feel like Greninja has such a good kit for abusing that recovery. Oh, yeah, for sure. Oh, barely missing that back air. He was so close to connecting that on Tweak. Like, so, so... Is that going to... Wow, that almost killed... Wow, he almost stepped on him again. <laughs> that, that, that second one, definitely probably... I won't say definitely, but might have killed. Tweak definitely looking nice with the, uh, the, the way that is. I love Snapping it. Snapping on him. Okay, there's the down tilt into the forward air, even middle stage, and that's the crazy thing about town. The blast zones are so gigantic. The back air will catch that normal getup, though. Venia closing it out with so much rage, 172 on this man. Yeah, he is he's big chilling on the stock. I, I don't see Tweak struggling too much to take out the stock, but Venia's being very smart about how he's striking on Tweak. He's trying to keep a really good distance. Ooh, down throw managing to not kill. Not even air? Oh, he, he got the jump call out, but... Very good air drift from Venia, but was still able to clean it up with the backwards aerial there at the end. Let's see, what do we got? Yeah, you can't really get too much off of just up air if you're not getting the drag down, especially on Greninja. Been one of the more difficult characters to get a uh, longer string for Joker, yeah. but he's a character that you could very often like reset into neutral and then just get your two-piece. And when you have Arsene, that two-piece matters. Yes, that two-piece is 50 damage. It's pretty <laughs> crazy. Ooh, tried to mix him up with there with the down air. Comes a down throw, but does not able to uh, connect an aerial after. Look at that dash tag again, just scooping up. Are you dead? Yep. Town and City coming to the rescue, man. This counter pick is working out so well for Venia. I like the saw. He went all the way to the bottom there just to make sure the Arsene timer would run out. Ooh, but the back air will prevail here. Are we going to set up for this ledge trap? No, just going to shoot him all the way on the way down here. Or till still not enough, man. These stages, blast ones are so large. He's doing a great job of racking up this damage, though. Not committing too hard to these edge guards, I think, is perfectly fine. But can he take the stock? Because we saw in the first stock that Venia lived to, like, 170-something. You know what I mean? Like, that's it's a very large tank of rage. <laughs> Indeed, but... Take note of the fact that Tweak did a good job of being able to stall out majority of the uh, platformless layout. Yeah. And I think that's even more important, because now when he does manage to take, take the stock, it, eventually... Um, Another, the next grab or back air, yeah, we'll, we'll take the stock, so... Like, Venny has got the triplat layout to worry about. And this probably gives the most options to Joker out of the three layouts of Town and City. 
Ooh, wow, really good DI. Did not get caught up by the up smash to follow from that down tilt. But the forward air connects. Gonna set up for this offstage situation. Gonna take the ledge trap. Wow, looks like he dashed the through him there. Oh, he, he called the out that guns. jump, but the gun is so Oh, good. no! Oh, man, I, I thought the up air was coming. <laughs> Yeah, with, with no plats to, to help the follow-up, he couldn't get much off of Awakened up tilt, but he's chilling. Yeah, especially when, when you're when you're Arsene in this position, you're like up a stock, and you get it earlier when they're at earlier percent, you, you're kind of content with just getting damage with this Arsene, you know what I mean? A lot of side B or guns. Well, it's weak, it looks like he's trying to shark around and end this out as early as he can. Don't blame him, he's already losing he's his Arsene, he's losing out. his second to last stock. Yeah. Right there, Tweak tried to set up another situation with the gun, but Fenny was just a little bit faster on the punch and was able to catch him before the gun hitboxes came out. So really great adjustment coming out from Fenny. Yeah, that's the only reason why I'm not that big a fan of the uh, the full hop guns coming from Tweak. Mostly because Greninja is fast enough to be able to properly punish that. Not only can he get out of that zone where Tweak is able to drift around with the guns, but he's able to position himself to properly Oof. punish. Damn. But a back air from Tweak is what's going to secure game three, moving us to the 2-1 count. It's <laughs> uh, I've watched a lot of Tweak sets, but man, this kid can move. He is quick, just like that back air, man. Man. And you put a character in his hands that's as nimble as Joker. He's able to put some damage onto that. Yeah. Yeah, that, that was just very, very solid. And you, you can just tell, like I said earlier, um, he's getting very, very comfortable with the gun, with the AR. Uh, it's just, and those are... Tweak definitely loves character, or he, he has more fun with characters when you do like more B reverses. They have a little bit more quote unquote swag to them, you know what I mean? They have a lot more fun with them. And I, I feel like he's definitely having fun with Joker at this, at this tournament. I think Joker's a great pick for him. It's a character that gives him options for, for mixing things up as he needs. Not for the sake of like effectiveness, but like it's a sense of variety. He's not doing the same things in different ways. It's like, I feel like Joker's like the polar opposite of, of Palutena. Mm. Where, like, she has a lot of ways of doing the same thing with right. the few tools that she has. Whereas with Joker, you can effectively use all of his tools, and they'll have some sort of impact on the match. So how do you feel about this, this song playing right now? This song? Oh, we're taking a leisurely stroll. <laughs> definitely, I, I, I definitely can dig the song, but... You know, you guys might have to not, get on the switch and change up some music. Yeah, not, <laughs> not not for like thunderstorms, <laughs> lightning in the background, <laughs> this castle arisen from the ground. This yep. is potentially Venia's last life on the winter side of bracket. Ooh, are you dead? Wow, he almost oh, died to that. No, that he's dead yeah, now. He's dead. He couldn't even make so, it back. Out of the legal stages, Unova Pokemon League is probably the worst as far as the range that Joker has for recovering with grappling hook. The stage, especially on the left-hand side, is not forgiving to where Grappling Hook detects the ledge. Okay, wow. Yeah, it's it's really it's really screwy. And on the right-hand stage, if if Tweak is too inwards on the stage, he can't just up the upwards because the little lip of Unova, the one that's infamous for denying teleport characters their recovery, right. will just deny the Grappling Hook. It'll actually bounce off the job. Oh, I've seen that happen. Like, it'll bounce off. Like, yeah. It's like, why is this happening? <laughs> Yeah, this stage, kind of grimy for fighting Joker against, even though Joker can use the, the stage itself very well. I mean, you know what? Sometimes Arsene don't play fair, so I, I think it's fair game. <laughs> right now, Venia still keeping the pressure on. I mean, very solid lead here. It's even stock, but this first Arsene going away and only 5% here on Venia is a very big deal. But look at that down gun comboing straight in. And wow, we're comforting. 46% off of that, but the counter comes in, and just like that, Benny up an entire stock. Ooh, gets the dash attack on the tech chase, and man, up again, and just gonna bring out another Arsene. This stage is also really good for Benny confirming his up smashes. If I remember correctly, the platforms are just so high enough on Unova that they're not going to consistently interrupt up smash one to two. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it, it definitely looks like it's working out for him. Gonna be a re-grab here, but uses the wall jump. Gets the parry, but the down tilt going the wrong direction here for Tweak. The drag down, no. Gets the fully connected up air. He probably wanted the drag down for the up smash. Yeah. But I, that, that's a big break for Venia because no Arsene. Oh, what a call out, though. Just gonna get this raw up smash. And Tweak not taking too much damage, honestly. He's probably gonna have one more Arsene. Yeah, realistically, he should have, like, one more true, like, 
his turn, like his right to play the game. And he's got to make that count. He's got to do it once he gets his Arsene. But taking a little bit of a beating before we're even there, about a third of the meter charged up. And that's big, too, because, like I said, if your Arsene comes out and your opponent is at lower percents, like, that's just not good. You know what I mean? You have to be able to rack up this percent as non-Arsene Joker. Ooh, very nice DI mix-up from Venia. Just DIing in, really catching Tweak off guard. Ooh. And the jump call out will do it. The back air seals it out. And once again, Korean, we're finding ourselves in game five. Game five territory. Of course, this time it is going to be Tweak's counterpick. So we'll see what stage Tweak goes to. I mean, last time we saw him counterpick, it was going to Smashville, right? Correct. So maybe we'll just go back to Smashville again. I'm not too sure if DSR is in effect. No, nope, no. Nope. Guess not. They're all right with it. All right, so game five, Venia versus Tweak. This is this is great because Venia had a game five set with uh, the Buzz as well, right? Indeed. Yeah, so I mean, just a lot of these Venia sets, very, very hype, going down to the wire here. You know, I feel like this is an apt time to uh, also give a little bit of a reminder to the audience. These two have played before. They played at Let's Make Moves. Damn, that's a wild That back. was a wild back. And... We kind of gave the hands to Venia. It was a loss he was not proud of at all. Okay. So uh, I'm assuming Wario. No. This was actually Tweet's Donkey Kong Dang. right before he unveiled his Wario to the world. Okay. So this is like we're really backtracking for Tweak means <laughs> at that point. Okay, but this Arsene already racking up quite a bit of damage here. Okay, but this Arsene is pretty fresh. Does not grab the normal getup, but we do get some trades here. Can Venia catch the landing? Oh, Up man. Gets him. That is... Remember when I told you about that down air, that's the knife swipe? Yep, so it swiped important. him right into it. And, I mean, we're not on town anymore, so the high ceiling is not going to be able to uh, save Venia from that confirm. And now Tweak, like, that. that's the crazy turnaround you can get with Arsene, right? You, you get the dare at 60 and get a stock. Like, that's wild. Like, Arsene just gives you so much when you're already at advantage. Yeah, Arsene giveth and he taketh away. Indeed. <laughs> Although Tweak doing just fine without the funny man. He's, he's sitting pretty Ooh. with control of the stage, already having lapped Venia in percentage. These, these down guns, this move is so good. It's just, even if you do manage to recover, you have to do it in a different method that you wanted to, and you're still going to take a little bit of damage on the way up. Some characters just outright die to it, wow. but how about dying to yet another up smash? Yeah, and I, Tweak's up smashes are so on point with this character. There's the forward air. Still not enough, though. The rage is too low. And the thing about when Tweak uses gun as well, most of the time he's just drifting back on the stage. So it's like he's going to get some chip damage out, like could commit if he wants to, or he could just go back for the ledge trap. You're getting so much damage. And like at, most of the time when we see... Joker in a juggle situation, it's there to help him out too. It's, he's one of the hardest characters in the game to juggle, in my opinion. All right, what are Shuriken actually managing to take a kill? Yeah, uh, I mean, you don't see that all the time, right? No, not. <laughs> a, I, I haven't seen Venia take a stock with that in the longest. And that was such an important stock to take too because he didn't get a lot of damage down. Arson was live and gone now for just a little bit longer. Yeah, but Tweak's still up an entire stock here. Let's see if Venia can get something started here. And we see Tweak playing very, very patient, utilizing the other gun variant, just the normal gun. He <laughs> shoots horizontally. Very, very great tool. I mean, like I said, time and time again, gun is so versatile for this character. It's so good. Mind you, lateral guns, a little bit uh, less useful in this matchup, just because... Just because of the shortness, yeah. Yeah. Like, most characters, Joker can just short hop gun, and you're still putting out that long-range pressure. Right. Knocker and Ninja. Yeah, you got to sink the gun very, very low, which is usually unlikely. That dash attack, almost threatening kill. What's the response on the ledge? We see oh, the... Oh, DI in. Oh, and you, he even crosses DI up Ooh. on the up air. He almost died to that. <laughs> Man. Oh, no. We're going to see the up smash out of shield. It's going to be game five going to TSM Tweak, who's going to sit in the winner's side grand finals for tonight's tournament.